Hey guys, welcome to the first episode of my Let's Play. This is going to be just a random Let's Play of the expansion packs that I have. Hopefully we're going to go through all the generations that we're going to go through um, in general. So we're going to start off choosing the season. I'm just, I'm going to go with summer because spring and summer are kind of the same in the game. So I'm going to start in summer. That way we go from summer, fall, winter to spring. Uh, that will be a full year here in the Sims world. Now we're playing with a family. Their last name is London. We start with twenty-four thousand dollars, like most people do. Um, I'm gonna leave twenty-four there, so it all depends on where we choose to live. Where should we live? Um, oh, this is so hard. What about London Bay? I may end up getting a house on Oh hang on. Forget about this of course. Two bedrooms. Yeah, I'm gonna go this one. So in Little Creek, I think we are, we're clicking on the Creek Cabana. It has two bedrooms, one bathroom, 13,000. We're gonna move into this place. And we're gonna go furnish so we can have a look at what we have. Alright guys. How are we going today? Welcome to the first episode of my Let's Play and today we are here with the London family. This is a family that I've quickly put together um, in Creator Sim. I haven't, they've got their everyday outfits but I haven't really gone about doing any of their other outfits so we'll see what they have and if it's really really bad we'll jump into Creator Sim and change that. Now the first person here we've got Christina. Uh, Christina welcome to the show. She is a divorcee, recently divorced, uh, unfortunately her ex-husband cheated on her. She, they didn't have a house or anything, so she had to move out into, what did I say, uh, the Creek Cabana, here in Willow Creek. Single parent of two lovely boys, and here we have, um, I forgot their names. We have Marcus and Chester. This one's Chester. Chester is going to be our creative painter prodigy. I can't say that word. And Marcus is our social butterfly. And his aim in life is to just know everybody. He'll probably end up going into the Get Famous expansion pack. So we will follow his career. As well as Chester here. He's going to be probably a musician. Most likely a musician painter for that kind of field. So we're going to follow these guys as they, as they progress through their everyday life. Uh, Christina has recently graduated from med school so we're going to go ahead and get her some stuff. Everything keeps shining because I just reinstalled our sims onto my computer so they think that this is the first time I'm playing the sims. So let's just have a quick look at the house. We've got our very simple, simple setup here. I'm going to swap out the room here. So I'm going to jump into build by mode real quick. Um, we are going to save as much money as we can with some stuff, so we'll just change the building so we know whose bed is who. Um, I think, I mean, I know that the kids don't seem to have a ton of stuff to play with, but we only have 10 grand. So our first thing that we're going to do um, is, technically it's Sunday in the Sims, so... We'll just play. I'm going to try and get to five to 15,000 before we start buying anything. So the first thing we're going to do... Oh, tomorrow's going to be a scorcher and all these guys have school. So I haven't added anything to this calendar or anything like that. So we've just got like, and there's nothing in summer. We can always add something if you wish, but I'm, I'm pretty good. Fall, we have Harvest Fest, which is basically Thanksgiving. Winter, we have Winter Fest, which is Christmas and then New Year's. And then in spring, we have Love Day. We can always add a holiday. If anyone has suggestions, please comment down below what kind of holiday would be fun to do. Um, I haven't played with the holidays too much, so I'm more than happy to accommodate what, what you guys want. So we're going to call up with Christina's phone. 
give you a job. Find a job. And we'll get these guys talking. Talk about toys. Make a friend. <laughs> um, and you've just graduated med school, so we're going to have to let you in here. Christina is now a medical intern at Cut and Gut Health. She starts Monday at 7 a.m. So, Christina, what do we have to do? Attend an active work day. That's cool, we can do that because this is this is not a rabbit hole career. We'll get to go along while the kids are at work and we'll be able to have some fun with that. I don't think there's there's nothing we have to do except attend. Go on two days. So she she wants to find a soulmate after her dirty ass husband um screwed that up for her. So that wasn't very nice. I mean they didn't have much, they were beginning, she just graduated from med school, so she wasn't really doing too well uh, financially anyway. The husband was clearly a deadbeat if all she got was 24 grand. 13 of it went to the house that she's just bought for her and her two kids. She's only got enough money to buy an extra bed. Um, so we're going to try and get these up, these guys up to at least 100,000 by the end of... Oh, what am I going to say? By the end of their generation. So when these kids grow up. And she's gone. When Christina has passed away, we're going to try and get up to $100,000. We're going to try. We're going to try. Alright, we're going to definitely try. But okay, so but she still wants to find her soulmate, even though she's just divorced and doesn't really want anything. So we need to get her a boyfriend or girlfriend. Let's not um, genderize here. And go on two dates. Marcus here. He's a social butterfly, like I said before. But he needs to meet five new sims. So we, I don't know if this technically counts, but he did. Chester counted for that. And Chester is artistic, so have an activity table and draw two pictures to be inspired. I think we could probably do that, to be honest. Like, why not? Chuck in an activity table. I do apologize for some of the slowness of my computer. It, it's the computer I play off is a 2000 and late 2012, early 2013 MacBook, MacBook Pro. Um, oh, I can't even spell activities. Jeez! Activity, kids, activities. Um, let's yes. Turn that around. Um, so, I've done a couple of mods to it. I've added a new hard drive, things like that. I want to add, you know, new memory and all that kind of stuff, but we will get there. So, now, we're going to play on this. I have a combo. Oops. What are you doing? Well, let's hug these boys. They're my boys and my world. I love you guys so much. Well, how about a hug? Oh, reach parenting level one. Christina is can now encourage kids' behavior and influence kids to clean. She can now reprimand. That's the word. Bad behavior by asking the child not to do that action or simply yelling at the child to stop. Is, are you making fun of someone? Parenting, let's see. Are they going to teach you to say sorry? Because you shouldn't be doing stuff like that. Go to social skill. Conflict resolution. We're doing pretty well so far. Being a good parent. Um, so, you just need to go to school. Actually, what we're going to do is, what's this? What do you keep shining? Should we join a club? Yeah, we're going to join a club. Now, he is social, so of course he's going to be... I don't even know, Spoon Masters DJs. Take the word perfection. Should we apply for an invite? Adventurous nice to head. Uh... We're going to create a club. Um, yeah, it's over invitation. I don't know, I don't know what we're going to call this. What are they? What's a baby king? A baby king is called a joey. So we're going to call it joey. The club's going to be joey because it's a baby king Um, A place for 
kids to hang. That's what we're gonna do. Now, the requirement is age, must be a child. Should we do teens? No, we're, gonna, we're, just, we're just gonna do kids. Um, I'm just gonna say that because no one should just worry about this, really. Um, okay, so we're gonna eat. That would be a good one. Eating is always good. Uh, what about homework? Is it homework, I think? Kid activities? Do you remember? We're gonna do that. That's good. We've gotta keep those grades up. Uh, I'm gonna say play with toys because we're kids. We play with toys. Play and Ansible. What about music? Dance? Do a bit of dancing. Dancing's always good. Um, I'm gonna say paint. Because kids do that. What about hobby? Do some hobby. We read. I think reading is always important. So we're gonna, I'm gonna add Chester, um, Orange Bailey Moon, Pierce Delgato, Delgado. We're gonna have some girls. So we'll go. We're gonna have Alexander Goss, Billy, Billy Jane, Chain, Olivia Kim Lewis, and there's one, two, three boys. We'll make it even. Elsa. Bjornsson? So they've all been invited? Yay! Oh, we don't have a picture. What kind of picture should we have? I'm gonna say the glasses. The glasses are cool. Alright, we have a club. Yay! Chester was. Congratulations, Chester was accepted into Joey. Congratulations, Marcus has successfully created the Joey Club. Now it's time to recruit new members and hit the town. Well, we're not going to do it. That is fun. But, actually, we'll start a gathering. Joey Club Gathering has started. Club members have been notified and they are on their way. First things first, let's do some homework! And while uh, after that, you can do your homework. And then we will work on you. I don't know what we're going to do. It's going to be all these strange kids that I've never met at my house. As, have you guys ever played The Sims and just like talk to yourself the entire time because that's, that's what needs to happen? <laughs> you told yourself like, no, I don't want you to do this. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get mum to do some cooking. She's gotta provide for a family. Um, and we need some dinner. So we're gonna go good old mac and cheese. We're gonna do family size. Do four. Oh, we're gonna go. They're all green, they're all happy. Oh, he's confident. Nice work. Let's um, tell unbelievable story. Do your homework. Yeah, you do your homework. Okay, I'm going to speed this up a little bit. Oh, who's this? Travis Scott. I must admit, previously when I played The Sims, Whenever I play The Sims, this guy is really hard to befriend. We're gonna try. We're gonna do a friendly introduction. And we'll invite him in. Let's see how that goes. Come on, Mum. What do you mean you can't go anywhere? This, this is also something I freaking hate in this game. I constantly tell. Okay, can you. Hang on. Is my door shut? Like, is. Like, are you locked? Okay, it's not locked. Okay, so something's in the Okay, how about we just. Funny introduction. Yay, completed your homework! What? See, this is something I do not understand. Can I go, like, go here? How about we do that? Okay, so we can. This is insane. Funny introduction. Talk to him. Christina, talk to him. Do you want a partner? Like, I mean, or do you want friends? It's always good to have friends. So we're just gonna make some introductions, get to know some people, um, ask about careers. Okay, 
Alright, what are you doing? You're eating. So, yeah. I don't really know. Alright, so everybody. Okay, fine, leave. Everybody seems to have finished their homework. Let's go. Yes, everyone's finished their homework. Yay! Now leave my house. This is like the worst part. No one ever leaves. Um, goodbye. Wait, is that just no? Yeah, you can hang out. I don't know. You can leave. No, you leave here. <laughs> Call names, ask to hang out, ask to come out. Okay, everyone can leave. So, now you can tell Christina has this mum look. Look at her. Her mismatched shoes, pants, and shirt. And... <sighs> okay, discuss the latest book. How do we feel about that? Christina is a bookworm. Bookworms are inspired by books and love to discuss them with other siblings. Get to know. He's a geek, so that's good. You probably get along well with my kids. I acquired their Christmas skill. Heaven forbid. Christina's, in, Christina's new skill is Intravisma, will allow her to successfully joke more frequently and learn about other things faster. More varied types of interactions unlock at higher levels. Yeah, but figure that out. <gasps> you are not messing up my house! Excuse me! Rude introduction. Rude. You. Get out of my house. You literally made a mess of clean up. Like, actually, no, you cleaned up because you. Another sentence. Oh, oh, thank you. Clean that up, young man. I can't believe it. You, you just walk into someone else's house and you just. Put paint all over the floor. So we're gonna encourage you to clean up that mess. You're gonna be a good man. Can you like I don't like you anymore? Can you leave? Ask to leave. Can you, yeah. Thank you, Chester. Hug love me. Well done. You're a good kid. Can you leave too? Because I don't I don't want anyone here anymore. <gasps> Why are they doing this? You are not to have friends over ever again. Ever. Because that is not cool. But I like it. We're going to go in that deep conversation. Go outside. Outside. Now. Okay, you need to. Oh, you want to sit like that? One day. One day we'll play. Um, don't use that language. You little anger. I don't know what that means. Okay. Alright, so these guys seem to be having an alright conversation. Um, how about we ask about Karina? Uh, can we cloud guys? So we think we can. Okay. Leave, I tell you, leave. Now, I keep pausing because it's a um, bit of a habit that when I'm trying to do things, I just pause it. I'm going to try not to pause it. This Pick up the bed. Can you really get away? Yes, you should. I don't want you in my house because there's some random people. But you're, oh, you're focused. We'll ask you to hang out with me. Alright, so you're doing the arts because you're the arty man. You're gonna make me some summer crafts through your window. What, 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 what are you doing? What are you doing? Are you just gonna chat with him? Look at this! Such a nice brother. He's just gonna have a chat. They are twins, yes, they are twins for anybody who cares. Chester and Mark. Reach social level two. That would be you, I assume. Is this gonna be love? Is this gonna be love again? 
I hope so. I hope they find them. I hope they are able to love each other. Um, I'm sorry, but oh, I'm gonna ask him to hang out. Is he gonna say yes? Day. Hanging out sounds great. Maybe we should do it again sometime. Oh, no, they're just chatting. I thought you were gonna ask them to hang. Can we hug? <gasps> oh, yay! Are they friends? We're not gonna give you the house key because we all know how that can end. Ask to move in. That Look at ask to move in. That's a bit. Um, a bit forward. Just ask about his day. We don't, like, we really don't know him too well, do we? We know he's a geek. He's a tech guru, so that's cool. That's pretty cool, actually. Oh no, he's our friend and a neighbor. So I guess that's okay. I mean, if we go away, it would be a good idea. Okay, so he's gonna hang out. You're gonna go to the bar. Oh no, he's gonna leave. Oh, well, that's fine. That is totally fine. So what do you do? Just do something. It's funny how on the first day there's not much else you can do. Lonely recess. You haven't even gone to school yet. And apparently you've had a recess. Last recess, no one wanted to play with me. I just climbed around on my own. If that happens again, what should I do? And I love how there's only one option. Like, heaven forbid, maybe being alone is not a bad idea. Says someone who's playing The Sims. Ask other kids if you can join in. Which will increase his conflict resolution and decrease his emotional control. Thank you, Sims, for choosing for me. Okay, let's move on from that. Someone... Okay. Uh, now, I think... Yeah, I know that you're going to do that. You should probably clean up. I don't know why, I feel like I'm making him clean up because he kind of looks like Harry Potter. So he's like doing all, all the chores. And everyone ate my food. But that's fine because I'm going to have garden salad. That's my dinner. Reach level, level 2 parenting skill. Christina can now influence kids to do homework. Christina can now firmly tell her kids not to do bad behaviours. She also can select more options when responding to a teaching moment. Oh, That's cool. I, I normally don't read the little things that come up because it's just, yeah, okay, you gotta level up. But now that I know that you actually get better things as you go on through the game, it's kind of funny. Clean up. Clean up that back run air. Now, we're gonna... Clean that. No, that's... Yeah, that's the right one. Clean that up. Did you even make some of that? Draw two pictures while inspired. Now, this is the thing that annoys me. How would... Oh no, hang on. Cloud gaze. Let's go cloud gaze with me. More choices from the Asta Cloud Gate. Duh, and it becomes inspired. Man, I don't know how I play this game actually <laughs> What? That wasn't even for like five seconds. Just. What is your. Oh, you need to be. That could be why you're having your thing. Okay, now you're inspired, and you're probably going to get out of that inspiration in a second. Just go pee. Go pee. We'll see how long it takes, because then he might have to cloud gaze on his own. Okay, so draw shapes. Now what's your problem? It is 8 o'clock, being that you have school tomorrow. Um, you get another 20 minutes. Um, what's this? Um, we'll put that away, because I'm not too sure. No, you are not doing that. Um, okay, so we're gonna claim this. I'm going to ask mom to spray under the bed. Yay! And ask her to put me to sleep. <gasps> Phew! Hold your, I wonder, is it gonna... 
discipline their behaviors. Calmly, do not make a mess. As you should. Now clean that up, mister. And then you can ask. And then once you've done... Have you done one yet? No, wait, no, no, wait, no, no, you have to spray under the bed first, <laughs> otherwise you're going to end up with, just spray under the bed, and then you can go. I know that there's a lamp in the, I know there's a lamp that you can get in build mode that stops the bloody monster coming out, but I want to see if we can befriend it. Let's see if we can actually do that. How cool would that be if we can just do it? Go, 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 go. You're having fun yet? Okay, now go to sleep. Because it's almost midnight. And you should probably be in bed because you have to get up at like 6 o'clock in the morning to get to work by 7. Okay, they're up. They are having issues. What issues? Scared of monster and hungry. Okay, first things first. Go grab a quick meal and grab some syrup. And you're gonna go to the hut. And you're also gonna go grab a quick meal. Now I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> oh, sorry about that, guys. Alright, so they've gotta to get to school. I mean, yeah, to school. Um, and you are going to cook some fruit salad for yourself. Marcus has discovered something strange is under his bed. Oh, Marcus, mate, chill. Just chill, mate. Look, it's not even there anymore. Like, you can't see it, dude. So, just eat your food. Go to the bathroom. Alright, Chester, you're a good bloke. You've, I know you've had your issues. Scared of a monster. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry that happened to you. You have finished that too. Good job, bud. Marker. Alright, let's go to the shower. I have a quick shower. Christina's hospital shift is starting now. Care to join her? Or should Christina go to work online? Of course we're going to join her. Previously, I have played this... Um, expansion pack before the get to work one and the doctor i did find it hard at times because things would break down and then i'd spend the entire shift fixing it and that was annoying and hopefully this time it's not so hard. very 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 much we hope <laughs> i mean i like these little skills like the little tips and tricks that come up while you're in the waiting screen but the waiting kind of takes the fun out of life too. Okay. Clinical orientation. Welcome Christina London to a vital and rewarding career in the field of medicine. Being new to the job takes some time getting familiarized with the location, the people and the basic responsibilities of the profession. In time, with skill, dedication and passion to help her fellow sims, fellow sims, Christina will no doubt go far in her career. Okay, before I hit okay, I'm going to get a good summary of what we have to do today. Apparently, so far, because every time you finish one of these, it'll just give you another one until the day is over. We have to research health reports online, give brief to co-workers, and grab a snack between seeing patients. Okay. Apparently, my kids are off to school too. So we're going to hit OK. School for Chester starts in about an hour. They are on their own. Okay. So we're going to greet two co-workers. Now who are you? You're a nurse. You're third. So we're going to friendly introduction and assistant friendly introduction. So we greet one, greeted one, and we're going to greet number two in a second. And it says we're snack. Where are the snacks? Over here. It's buy snack. Uh, buy snack. Because we, 
we also have some more. Hey, okay, we found friends with Travis Scott. He's pretty cool. Go away. Okay, I don't know where she went to go see. Oh, she's talking. Okay. Wash hands to sterilize gems. Just go. I'm not seeing any patients yet because I want to get through this so we can get like a gold. Um, wash. Hang on. Discuss work with co-workers. Now, who are you? Your name is Kab Kabir? Kabar? No, there's no name. Uh, Kabir. So we're going to discuss, discuss, yeah, ask about salary. Seems like a very interesting thing to discuss on the first day. Isn't there like... I don't want to complain about work. Discuss work. Duh. No, discuss work. Eat and discuss work. Is he a potential husband for me? Why does he have cat ears? Like, why is that a thing? He has cat ears. No, get away from me. No. no. He has cat ears. Chat with co worker twice, so we're gonna go. We're gonna praise his work ethic. Uh, I'm gonna ask him about his salary. Being an assistant, no. What do you do? Complain about work to co worker. I'm gonna complain about why would that's why I never understood why would you complain about your co I mean I do it but that's just not the point. Okay, so now we're also going to no we're not gonna order. Why do we order? Wait, how do you oh hang on. Go over here. To this computer. This is research health reports. Any introductions that we can get to know people who don't have this issue. Oh, this is the one that I don't like. And she needs to go to the bathroom. That's why I'm like this. Uh, bathroom, here we go. Use. And we're going to wash our hands. Deliver food to a patient on an exam. Deliver food. Deliver food, look at that. Okay. No, you can don't do it. Just, uh, okay, that's fine. Here's your food. Chat with the patient. Alright. We will friendly introduction. Now who is this lady? We are chatting with Moira Fe Fares? Ferez? Where are you going? What are you doing? Just admit her. Ask a co-worker about their day. Ask about it. Now, let's do this. Apparently I... Chat with co-worker. Like, what? I just did that. Why do I have to do it again? Like, why does that make any sense? Make bed. It says make bed. Okay. Discuss work with co-worker. Have a cup of coffee. Assuming coffee, brew coffee. Now, actually, grab a drink. Okay. When you come over here, I'm gonna discuss work with our coffee. Friendly introduction to the patient. Yeah, tag tag. Tag tag. Chat with co worker. Praise worth it. Um, okay, Christina's workday will end in one hour. She should wrap up what she's doing. Each workday can be extended once by clicking the event timer. Uh, I don't really want to. Are you going to be drinking a cup of coffee? No, no, no. We deliver food again. Drink coffee. Here's your food. Enjoy your food. Yeah, end of shift. Christine did a fantastic job today. Promotions at Community House are surely in the future. Money earned. 188 bucks, you serious? Oh, getting to. 
<laughs> Level say 100,000 is going to be interesting. But apparently... I'm going to do some research, but I think apparently... The more patience you do, the higher the amount. But... Yeah, okay. So we're going to click that. Oh, waiting screen. So they need a total bed to sleep. Yeah, that's kind of fun. Dry leaf traps are infamous for starting fires. Remember to clean yours before it becomes a problem. What a day where Christina is back home as she has earned a hundred eighty dollars. Chester is back home from school. No need to make room on the refrigerated door. His work is immediately satisfactory. Marcus is done with school for the day. He is doing satisfactory work, but his teachers at Landgrab Elementary think he could easily improve with just a little extra effort. So we just pause this real quick. Now, you're hungry, you need some fun and hygiene, so we're going to get you have a shower. We're going to get you... What is this on? You know what? Just do a fruit salad. We should probably go there real quick. And then you can have... Oh, we don't have... We don't really have it. You don't have a hand sandwich. Um... Time more that stuff, we'll just put this on and then you can watch a movie with what should be kids cortex catas catastrophe. Is that it? Like, nah, we'll watch the, lo the lost dogs something, the lost dogs journey. So we'll just whoa in the bathroom, get out. Okay, now what do you need? You need the yeah, the. You need to eat? Why are you not eating? Oh, there we go. I'm pretty sure you're done. Like, come on. Watch Crime You can sit with me, that's nice. Just wanted to sit with me. It's very, very cute. We all watch a movie. But we will watch. We'll watch this Cortex Catastrophe. Right now. Just go to the bathroom. How about you just don't watch? And then you can watch it. You're lucky because you're also going to have to do homework. Yeah, what? You got see them. What's going on? No, oh, I need a bigger TV. This is gonna hurt so bad. <laughs> I want this to having fun watching it. Let me see too. Oh, everyone's doing the homework. Okay, help. Be a good mum. Help with homework. Even though it's like 2019 and the last time you did math is like 1987. Okay, I think you're giving him enough help. Good help. Oh, well, they both finished. <laughs> Alright, uh, seriously. How about we all go outside and see about me? That's cool, you get to like actually have a conversation about the movie you watched. I don't know why. Uh -huh. Oh, it is 9.50 guys, you, you should all be in bed. Um, Spran the bed. And put Chester to bed. And then Spran the bed. And put Marcus to bed. episode i'm sorry if it wasn't anything interesting but we're just getting started it's our first day it would, uh, i was hoping they would sleep through the whole night oh you need to no matter every time i tell them to go to the bathroom it's like they just don't do it 
Okay. Bring him and we'll give him a half shower because he's stinky. And then we're gonna be like the creepy person that watches them sleep. Come on. Yeah, you've had a shower. Come on. There we go. And that'll be it, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll be back next time with another episode of Let's Play. It's gonna be interesting. We're gonna do all the careers. And I'll uh I'll just see you next time.